Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel, Nut here. I am super excited to get into this one. We've got three boxes of the newly released Revolution uh, Premier League from Panini. We are looking for some of the uh, hobby exclusive inserts as listed. The Supersonic, Futures, Shockwave, and Ultra Rare Star Factors. Got some of the odds. We are looking for the Galactics, I believe they are the case hit. Uh, who are we looking for? We're looking for some of the rookies. In this class, we're looking for uh, Alejandro Garnacho, Julian Alvarez, Rico Lewis, to name a few. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. I am super excited. We have not had something to rip into for a little while. So three boxes of Revolution coming right up. All right, yeah, I could not be more excited. We, like I said, have not had something to rip into for a little while. That was probably the worst cut of all time as well. That was terrible. Uh, so yeah, you are not guaranteed an auto, but they are, uh, I believe, included one in every two boxes on average. Uh, th there's the auto checklist, is all right, honestly. And what I was, what I was seeing, looking for like David Beckham. Uh, I forget who the other one was. There was another good one. So, yeah, let's get right to it. Hopefully, no redemptions because I am waiting on I think four right now. Oh, all right. Cody Drummond. These cards look so cool. I mean, I. I mean, these cards look so cool. I mean, I. <laughs> no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. I've got to be honest. Oh, there's our autograph in the first uh, pack. I hate when that happens, man. <laughs> got Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank for Chelsea. See if this is, I believe this is just the base autograph, yep. So we'll get that guy sleeved up. And then Calvin Phillips, these guys. Uh, so yeah, just to show you some of the different parallels. So this is the diamond, the sunburst. These They look so cool. There's so many interesting little parallels. This guy's sleeved up. Alrighty, Jimmy Floyd Hasselbeck, or Bank. Keep opening the cards the wrong way. We've got another Cody Drummond. That's the Cubic, I believe. That's going to be numbered, if I recall correctly. Nope, that's the Infinite. I'm totally wrong. Jose Sa. And we've got a Jordan Zamora. Sharp looking card. Very cool. Alrighty. Start getting through these guys a little bit quicker now as we obviously do have three boxes of this stuff. So, at the Futures, Joe Gelhard, Mason Mount, what are you? A fractal. It's a fractal right there. Lewis O'Brien, Harvey Elliott, interestingly enough, not a rookie. And Pontius Janssen. Alrighty. Got five packs left in the first box. I'm slowly, as you guys can see, getting used to how to open these guys correctly. Got another infinite of Lissandro Martinez. Yep. Just had to double check there because there are so many parallels in this. It is nuts. Uh, I believe the numbered cards are a bit difficult to come by, actually, if I recall correctly. So, uh, obviously, makes them worth a tad bit more. I completely forgot there, as you can see. Again, <laughs> James Tarkowski. Fractal, Phil Foden, four more packs in this first box, and then we will get into the other two boxes. Corrected myself. Malcolm Ebiowi. Ebi Eb Taro. That was poor for me. That was not good. I'm usually uh, I'm usually pretty good with the name pronunciations. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't like to I don't like to toot my own horn too much, but played a lot of FIFA, so I'm pretty good with them. What is this? It's the boy, Bukayo Saka, supersonic. Sharp looking card. Nice. Chic Docure. That is going to be a fractal. This guy was on the box set, or on the uh, box art, rather, the promotional material. So, not too bad in that first box. We will uh, put some of the better cards. Oh! Got one, we got the last pack mojo here. Josh Da Silva, Raul Jimenez, Harry Kane. And then, yep, some more base. Man, these things look so cool. Box number two. 
Let's get into it. Box two. Hopefully we uh, pull that. Erling Holland. That was the autograph that I could not think of for the life of me. It took me, what, about four minutes to remember. Uh, hopefully that's who we pull. And hopefully we don't pull an autograph in the first pack. Oh, what are you? Is this a galactic? Oh, this might be a galactic. No, it's a cosmic. Nope. It's actually a cosmic three of 25. <laughs> Look at that. Sharp looking card. Trent Alexander Arnold. I mean, I don't know if you can tell by the jerseys behind me, but personally, I like this guy. Let him defend all day. <laughs> uh, we've got the diamond. Oh, the star factor. I think these are relatively rare too, if I recall correctly. Uh, the ultra rare star factor. Look at that. Star factor Jack Grealish. Just how rare... Uh, hard to say because we know that, you know, not sure if you guys are, have seen the Panini basketball, but uh, they call a lot of things super rare in that. And I've seen boxes where people pull the so-called so rare cards. They're pulling two and three of them. Uh, so hard to say. Uh, I do want to take a moment to mention, guys, I also actually over my right shoulder, I've got uh, a, a little PSA submission that's coming back to me. So definitely you guys are going to want to check that out as well. Uh, I'll be sure to drop the card for that guy uh, in the video. Harvey Elliott again. Everage easy. Man, the, that Cosmic Trent Alexander-Arnold looks so sharp. If that were a nice uh, nice rookie, you can just imagine. Because like I said, there, the numbered cards in the set, I believe, uh, are relatively hard to come by. So it means they hold the value a little bit better, obviously. Packs are outsmarting me a little bit. Sam Greenwood, Luis Diaz, Infinite, Phil Foden, a few more packs left in this guy. Oh, hello. Rico Lewis, Revolution Futures. Tim Ream, Fractal, a little bit of damage there. Up on the top of that card. Obviously, it's important to note stuff like that. Want to be a voice for the community. Got to be honest and transparent. Jaden Anthony, Emmanuel Dennis. And then some base. Last two packs of the second box. Adam Armstrong, Fractal. Um, wait, didn't we just... Huh. I thought we had pulled a Fractal. Not gonna lie, but we put him to the side. I could be mistaken. Uh, last pack of the second box. We've got Fabio Carvalho. Nice. Be uh, nice to see a, a numbered variant of that fella there. Would definitely be awesome. Uh, alrighty, into the last box, ladies and gentlemen. This has been a lot of fun already. Let's hope that we, we can uh, pull something big out of this last box. Would be a nice way to cap off the rip for sure. Then, going to get into our PSA action. That should be fun. Don't be surprised if you see me wearing the same shirt in that video because I am. Uh, I'm gonna get right into it. I'm. I'm in a. Uh, I'm in a mood to open some cards, even if they're cards that I already opened, and I'm just reopening them. Shuffle these packs up a little bit, actually. That way, the auto hopefully isn't in the first pack. Knock on wood. <clears throat> Tyro Malasia, nice. It's another rookie that we would uh, we'd love to see a numbered variant of, a numbered parallel rather. I don't know why I keep calling them variants. Like this is my first day on the job. We got oh Bukayo Saka, nice. So yeah, I thought we got a fractal a minute ago. I don't think the fractals are particularly rare. I believe we've gotten a few of them. Always a uh, face we'd like to see. Mr. Saka. Uh, 
we've got nothing here. A few more packs. Like I said, this has been a lot of fun. Uh, this is a set that is definitely new to me, so... Oh, well, that's Josh Da Silva. That's not too bad. Uh, that is going to be the Fractal as well. Just confirming that, yeah, we definitely have pulled a few of them. Uh, we've got nothing here. It does not appear. We're down to three packs. Let's see if we can uh, get something... There's another, I think, Sunburst. I'm gonna, I'm calling it. And we've got, it's the God Pack. Sunburst, let's go, I got it. Sweet. Uh, we'll get that guy sleeved up. And we are gonna put this to the side. I don't know who the redemption list is, but I have seen Holland autographs live, so. Uh, I'll take it. It was not a Holland autograph. Another Fractal. Wesley Fofana. And Jordan Zamora. Alrighty, last pack. And then we will get to the redemption. That's exciting stuff. Hopefully. Maybe not. I could just uh, be totally mistaken. So the Philip Coutinho. We'll get that guy sleeved up. These parallels do really look sharp. Pop out another little card stand here. Alrighty, let's see this redemption. Drum roll, please, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see, sit back for this one. Revolution, autographs, card number one. Bakari Sagna. John, do you feel you got what you deserve today? I feel physically sick, to be honest. I'm, I'm rapidly falling out of love with football. I just wonder what's the point anymore, you know. All righty. <laughs> we'll take it. Another autograph. We can never complain. Uh, realistically, this thing will probably become points, I assume, because uh, Panini has really not been on their redemption game lately, unfortunately, to say. Uh, so, yeah. Let's get into a little recap now, and then, uh, yeah, I'll give some thoughts on the set. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you guys were probably already yelling at me in the comments below, but I totally missed a card. Uh, <laughs> I was really surprised. Like I said, this just goes to show how you really have to, um, you know, look at the back of all these cards because there are so many different parallels. We actually, uh, I, I just mistakenly put it into the pile, a Cody Draman, or Drama from, uh, looks like, uh, Leeds here, rookie card, Sunburst 250. So we'll add that to the, uh, next to the Philip Coutinho Sunburst there. Uh, and yeah, all in all, a really, really fun set to rip. I mean, these cards just look so awesome. The way that they shine is, I mean, speaks for itself. Look at that. Looks crazy. So a lot of fun. Like I said, if you're ripping this stuff, go back through after you finish up. Look at the back of the cards because there are just so many uh, different types of refractors and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, all in all, a fun set. It's relatively affordable. Uh, I got to say, though, with stuff like Topps Chrome similarly priced um, as a flagship product, it's hard to really say, you know, rip this with this just being a league specific. Uh, not a great auto checklist, but it's a lot of fun. So if you have the ability to pick up a box, definitely go grab one. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, we've got a little PSA submission that has just come back. So we will be getting into that next. I'll be dropping the card for that video above. Uh, one more time, thank you guys so much for watching. Take care.